um, as we've gone through. So, before we tell you about our exciting plans for the new year, I'd like to start by giving some context to this year's WAVE campaign. We're taking a new approach this year, and we think it's important to share with you the thinking and reasoning behind the approach that we're taking. 2013 has been a hugely successful year for our brand, with, of course, the naming of Royal Princess in Southampton by Her Royal Highness the Duchess of Cambridge, a truly historic event for our brand, our travel agent partners, and the wider industry. We've seen the introduction of a dedicated trade sales team brought in to provide you with brand experts who are committed to passionately supporting you to sell Princess. More recently, we introduced our Cruise Extra campaign for 2014 sailings from September through till the end of November. This has been hugely successful, and we've overachieved on our even most ambitious targets. The contribution made to the success by you, our travel agent partners, has been absolutely massive, and we are hugely grateful for this. Travel agents booked over 15,000 passengers over the last three months on the campaign alone. So this is an absolutely brilliant result, so thank you. This success as well, overall in 2013, puts us in a great position moving into WAVE. Yes, we have some great dynamics to tell you about for the WAVE period, but we will be more focused than ever on ensuring that you, our agent partners, understand what makes Princess different, the reason our customers love us and come back time and time again. So when you are asked the question, why Princess in the new year, you can talk, talk confidently about why a Princess Cruise might just be the right choice for your customers to make new memories in 2014. So I'm now going to start by passing over to Shane, who's going to tell you a little bit about what is important to our brand. Thank you, Alex. It's absolutely my pleasure this morning to uh, take you through some really key moments, of key ideas of Princess Cruises that we feel really make Princess Cruises uh, an extra special product for our mutual customers. First of all, let's take a quick look at the Princess Cruises ethos. So we have four main beliefs at Princess Cruises, the first being that we offer a consummate host experience on board, which means our crew on board, our staff, uh, make sure we get to know our passengers and we get to know what makes our passengers tick and try and put a foresee what passengers uh, next request would be on board to try and foresee and make their holiday experience that little bit more special. We also do offer relax, rejuvenate and retreat at sea, but not only that, we are the destination experts, so we ensure that we do visit more ports of call than any other cruise line, which helps us to make these creating and lasting memories for our passengers. And that's really where our, the theme has come from for our Make New Memories campaign for WAVE. Uh, we are designed to making sure that we're creating fantastic memories for our passengers moving into 2014. So throughout the presentation, I'm going to be highlighting some really key ways that passengers do make some fantastic new memories on board Princess Cruises. Now, from an agent perspective, the really great thing about Princess Cruises is we do offer a consistent experience across the entire Princess Cruises fleet. So once you know one Princess Cruises ship, essentially you will know them all. This leads me on nicely to look at our Princess signature memories that we feature on board our ships. The first being Movies Under the Stars, followed by the Piazza, the Sanctuary, Cranger and Sabatini's, and of course that warm welcoming service that we've mentioned before. Now, as you can see from the quote on the screen, the core thing, the key thing about Princess Cruises is the fact that our passengers can now choose their cruise based on the itinerary and the ports of call that the cruise visits, rather than which ship is their favourite ship. Because essentially, every Princess Cruise ship could be their favourite. So, taking a little look further into some of these signature features that we have on board our fleet. Of course, Movies Under the Stars is probably the most famous feature uh, that we have on board our ship, and we were the first cruise line to really pioneer the outdoor cinema screen experience. Of course, while we have led, many other cruise lines have followed, but we don't feel that any other cruise line offers the same kind of level of experience that our customers feel when they are watching a movie Under the Stars with Princess Cruises. By that, I mean when you walk out onto top deck, you will get the fresh smell of popcorn wafting across the top deck. You'll be able to relax on a specially designed lounger with a special blanket and even a complimentary hot, hot chocolate on top deck on our Alaska voyages as well. Now, of course, we, we've seen that word a lot throughout the presentation, complimentary. So the popcorn is complimentary on board as well. Passengers can even sit back in the jacuzzi with a cocktail in hand and also watch the latest movies. So it's much more about bringing it to life for our for our prospective passengers and the fact that moving in the stars is so much more than just an outdoor cinema screen. It's all those little extra touches that we offer that really do add up to the princess difference. 
and of course we are known for escape completely so one of the opportunities for our passengers to really escape completely is by joining us in our sanctuary which is an adult only exclusive area normally found on the very top of the ship uh, the very top deck right at the very front so as I mentioned, it is an exclusive area for adults, so if people aren't traveling with children and they don't want to be traveling with other people's children, this is a really great way for them to uh, relax and let the serenity stewards take care of their every whim. Now they can also partake in our fresco massages and we'll also make sure they are well stocked with refreshing drinks and healthy snacks. We'll also provide them with MP3 players, they haven't, if they haven't provided their own, um, they can even listen to some of our latest playlists uh, designed for, from different areas around the world so they can experience a different culture that they'll be visiting whilst they are in the sanctuary. And on our newer ships, Royal Princess and Regal Princess, we will also be offering uh, private cabanas available for passengers that want to take that five-star service up to that six-star level of quality. Now, my personal favorite area on board the ship is the piazza. They just say there that this is our beating heart of the ship. So many cruise lines call this area the atrium. We call it the piazza because we feel that we've made this an entertainment venue within its own right. So the piazza does span several decks, and it is really inspired by the Italian street-style culture and those Italian squares of those famous cities. Now, in the, in the piazza, you will find the 24-hour complimentary international cafe, which provides uh, fantastic snacks, fantastic treats and pastries, all made fresh on board the ship that day. Now, the key thing to describe that, or the, the key way to describe it, is it's equivalent of walking into a Starbucks where you see all the pastries and the paninis behind the glass. And the main difference is, of course, it's all complimentary on board Princess Cruises. Now, on the opposite side of the piazza, you'll find Vines, which is our wine bar. And if you do order a drink in the Vines wine bar, you will also be able to enjoy complimentary sushi uh, and tapas in that bar as well. So, again, another complimentary offering from Princess Cruises. Now, as you can see in the video, the fantastic entertainment that does take place in the piazza does range from BMX stunt shows to circus-style acts to acrobatics. It's fantastic short entertainment that takes place in the piazza. So you can imagine as a family, somebody can go grab a slice of pizza, somebody can go grab a panini from the International Cafe, somebody can be enjoying some sushi from the wine bar, and you can still come back, sit together as a family in the piazza, and watch the fantastic street-style entertainment. And for ladies that are wishing to do some damage to their credit card whilst they're on board, uh, we do also offer some boutique shopping, which means that you can purchase some fantastic designer goods all at a discounted price on board. Now, of course, when you are selling any cruise line, I'm sure you all do talk about the fantastic food on board. But one thing that we really uh, pride ourselves at Princess Cruises is giving the, our passengers the opportunity of choice. So at Princess Cruises, again, another pioneering feature that we brought on board our ships was anytime dining. So passengers do have that choice to dine at a time that suits them. They can arrive at a restaurant at a time that they wish and be seated with whom they wish. It's especially uh, great for passengers that want to travel at a uh, diner at a table for two uh, because they can just request that. And if the table isn't available, they will receive a buzzer and we'll buzz them back as soon as the table is available. Passengers can also enjoy our award-winning uh, best pizza at sea on top deck. Uh, as you can see from the video, there's fantastic pizza, huge New York-style slices of pizza uh, that have won many, many awards, uh, and the latest being the best pizza at sea awarded by USA Today. Now, the key thing to point out about any of our dining choice on board Princess is the fact that every sauce, every soup, every pasta, and all other items that we can make on board, we will make fresh from scratch on board that ship. So the best way I describe it is if there is a spaghetti bolognese on the menu, some passengers might think that we have maybe five litre jars of Dolmeo in the ship stores. That's not the case. We make every sauce from scratch as well. So we make sure that all the cuisine is completely fresh. And for some passengers, this will be the first time they're experiencing uh, some fr uh, completely fresh cuisine on board Princess. Now, I talked about the very beginning of my section and the fact that we do offer a consistent experience across our ships. Now, we would, from next year, we will have 18 amazing ships sailing over 330 ports of call, and we'll have our brand new ships, Royal and Regal Princess, sailing in Europe in 2014. Now, we do obviously offer a variety of ship sizes, depending on what passengers, uh, what suits their, their requirements. But one thing that you can be sure of is every Princess Cruiser ship is our best ship. As you can see there on the right-hand side, you can see how many awards we've managed to rack up uh, with our fantastic fleet, such as top large cruise ship, top medium cruise ship, um, and also along the lines of highest client satisfaction. 
most recently, Royal Princess picked up an Innovation Award for our Fantastic Sea Walk, and she also picked up an award for Best New Ship at Cruise Awards 2013. One of our biggest, uh, biggest moments this year that we are most proud of is the fact that Princess Cruise is the only cruise line in the entire world to receive which status recommended provider. We're the only cruise line to receive this status, and it's a fantastic third-party endorsement for passengers that are looking to perhaps cruise for a first time or perhaps move from one of our competitors to travel with Princess Cruises. You'll see the logo that's highlighted on your screen will feature an, a, a prominent position on all of our new edition brochures and all of our new points of sale moving forward. So if you are creating any points of sale on our behalf, please make sure you do contact your regional sales manager or account manager uh, to ask us how you can use this WITCH logo uh, to provide that third-party endorsement for Princess. Now we talk about Princess Cruises being the destination expert. Now for us, the destination is as important as the journey. And what better way to make that evident is the fact that we picked up our best cruise line itinerary for nine consecutive years. And just to highlight to you some of the ports of call, uh, some of the areas of the world that we do travel to. We do like to think if there's an ocean, uh, Princess Cruises can certainly take you there. Namely Alaska, uh, we've picked up best cruise line in Alaska for several years, as you can see in front of you. Uh, so if you do have any, uh, any passengers inquiring about Alaska, Princess Cruises should absolutely be your first port of call. As I mentioned, we do have two of our brand new ships sailing in Europe for next year. But you can see there, again, another recommendation that we also picked up best northern Europe itineraries. If also, if you look, you've got passengers that are looking to experience the Panama Canal, you should really look to Princess Cruises as we're the only cruise line to offer two Panamax designed ships specifically designed uh, for the Panama Canal region. Now, it's great news for 2014 as we are expanding our portfolio even further uh, to offer fantastic round-trip sailings from Singapore. So Sapphire Princess will be based in Singapore for 2014, and we'll also be offering Diamond and Sun Princess in Japan from April through to October. Now, one of my personal favorites is we will be returning uh, back to the Rockies in 2014, operating 13-night cruise tours that originate in Calgary, and passengers can experience the famous Rocky Mountaineer journey through the clouds rail service, which operates from Jasper via Kamloops down into Vancouver, where our passengers can then jump on Pacific Princess for a seven-night Alaska sailing. And when we talk about being the destination expert, it's not just about sailing around on our beautiful ships and just arriving at these ports of call. We do try and make sure that each of our cruisers does offer an immersive destination experience. So, for example, when our passengers are joining us in Hawaii, we do offer a Aloha Spirit program on board, which will mean that our menus will have a hint of local cuisine. It does mean that we'll have some local style entertainment and local arts and crafts on board, so the passengers really do get to experience the culture of their destinations. We are one of the only cruise lines to guarantee that we will also visit two glaciers on our Alaska voyages. And similar to our, to our Hawaii program, our Japanese sailings will also have a hint and flavor of the Japanese culture uh, around, along the way on our Japanese sailings. Now, passengers that are lucky enough to join us on our Caribbean sailings will have the opportunity to also visit Princess Cays, which is our exclusive island in the Bahamas. And it's a fantastic opportunity for passengers to sit back on the beach, relax, and enjoy the princess service on shore. Now, we do appreciate, as a destination expert, some ports of call do require a little bit more time uh, than others. So for that reason, we've also built in two-day experiences uh, in amazing ports that should require it, such as Hong Kong, St. Petersburg, and many, many more. Now, as you can see there on the picture on the bottom right-hand corner, uh, it's fantastic to be able to sit on top deck in somewhere like Hong Kong and watch the skyscrapers put on their light show uh, while you're still enjoying movies under the stars. Now, for those passengers that are looking to explore the Panama Canal, as I mentioned earlier, we do have two ships specifically designed for this area, uh, but we offer, also offer the two-day Panama Canal experience uh, with a full day in Fuerte Amador, which allows the passengers the opportunity to experience a little bit more about the construction of this marvel of the world. Now, we do talk a lot about the Princess Difference. So these are just some of the key features to be able to highlight to your passengers of what they will experience from Princess, which really elevates us to a premium product. Now, if you imagine the passengers have spent a day ashore, and be, when they come back to the ship, they will be greeted with a chilled face cloth at the gangway to freshen up before boarding the vessel. We also do have misting stewards at the poolside. So again, if it's a warm day, we'll have somebody there to mist them down to make sure our guests don't get too hot whilst they're traveling with us. 
Also on top deck, passengers can enjoy complimentary, refreshing, cloudy lemonade. Again, this is another feature that we've added on board uh, as a complimentary offering for passengers uh, to be able to sit back, relax with the lemonade, uh, and enjoy the sunshine. Also on our Alaska Voyage, as I mentioned earlier, we do have our hot chocolate, and also we do have the waffle stations on board our fleet for breakfast and afternoon tea. Now, one of my personal favorites is the fact that we do also have a cookie host on board that does serve our passengers with warm cookies and chilled milk at the poolside. So, again, I've, been, I've had a nice opportunity to experience this several times, and I always witness passengers asking how much these cookies and how much the milk is, and they're always blown away uh, when they find out it's actually another complimentary offering to our guests as well. And, of course, the creamy soft serve ice cream is available on top deck. Uh, so passengers, for children and uh, big kids alike, if the passengers do like ice cream, then they're safe to know that they don't have to put their hand in the pocket to enjoy our soft serve ice cream on top deck. Now, like many cruise lines, I'm sure you talk about the entertainment. Uh, Princess Cruises does also have the fantastic entertainment that people have come to expect from cruise lines nowadays. We do also have our full West End style production shows and our full theatre and evening entertainment programme. But one thing I did want to highlight to you, one thing that's quite unique to Princess, is we do offer a scholarship at sea program. So passengers do get an opportunity to enjoy something probably a little bit different than they would at home and maybe try something that they've never had an opportunity to try. Such as our Princess Pop Choir, we do have any budding X Factor winners out there and our guests can join us for the Princess Pop Choir and an opportunity to maybe have a few lessons uh, in singing to, to enhance their skills a little bit further. We also offer culinary arts and wine taste in our galleries, as well as creativity at sea. So for those guests that want to maybe get their, their fingers dirty with clay pottery or with a bit of arts and crafts, uh, then they can enjoy the creativity at sea program. Likewise, if passengers want to learn a little bit more about how we get our magnificent ships from A to B, they can join us to learn a little bit more about the navigation at sea program, where we still use a satellite navigation system, but the charts and maps are equally as important. So we'll explain to them how we still use the charts and maps this day and age. Now, one of the biggest reasons why we do have our guests coming back to Princess Cruises time and time again, and one of the things that will make your life a lot easier, is the fact that our Princess guests can book with confidence. So Princess Cruises passengers can book early, safe in the knowledge that should they need to cancel or move on to another voyage, uh, they can do so absolutely free of charge 180 days before departure. Also, our Princess Captain Circle is one of the richest loyalty schemes at sea. And our most elite passengers uh, will receive some fantastic benefits ranging from complimentary minibar, complimentary laundry, wine tasting, complimentary internet, onboard discounts, and many, many more. So this is the reason why we're constantly awarded with the highest client satisfaction, and it does keep our guests coming back to us time and time again. Now, the moment you have all been waiting for, I've explained to you how we're going to make some fantastic memories for our customers in 2014. But I'm going to pass you back over to Alex, who will tell us more about our new WAVE campaign starting on the 26th of December. Thank you very much, Shane. So we will be giving passengers an amazing three-for-free free offer for bookings made between the 26th of December this year and the 28th of February 2014. There's three parts to this three for free offer. So as Shane's talked about, we're the destination expert. So what better way to soak up some of the unforgettable views of the more than 330 ports of call we visit each year with a free balcony upgrade for your passengers. Secondly, a great way to create lasting memories is by discovering days out in the wonderful destinations we visit. So in ways this year, we'll be giving $100 per couple towards one of our amazing shore excursions. A few people have asked in previous webinars how this will work, and it will be simply added to their onboard account, much like an onboard credit would, as we've done in the past. Lastly, to make your customers' memories last forever, we will be throwing in a free formal photograph and frame on board for each cabin. The great thing about these offers, they are all combinable with one another, so your customers will be able to make wonderful new memories when they book with Princess Cruises this new year. In addition, we'll be offering third and fourth passenger fares from just £99 per person and a lower deposit also of just £99 per person. So there has never been a more affordable time for your customers to book with Princess. And a really, really important thing to remember is that all of these offers are combinable with your Princess groups, meaning you can offer even more value to your customers by taking out and setting up groups for this wave period. 
So moving on to the next slide, we're not just making new memories for our customers and your customers, we're also going to be creating memories for our travel agent partners. So to celebrate our campaign, we will be giving away unique experiences to all of you throughout the whole wave period. These are going to include experience such as luxury afternoon tea for two, House of Fraser shopping sprees, and my personal favorite, an Aston Martin driving thrill, just to name a few. These experiences and prizes will be announced each week on our Princess Weekly Bulletin, and we will also announce the winners from the previous week um, before that. So it's really important that you're keeping an eye out for that each Monday with that coming through. To enter the competition, all you need to do is make a booking and send your booking reference each time to competitions at princesscruises.co.uk. And you should send in an email for each booking you make. And the reason for that is the more times you send a booking reference in, the better chance you've got of being picked out as one of the winners. If you're not already receiving the weekly bulletin, please email sales team at princesscruises.co.uk to be added to our distribution list. Or alternatively, enter your email address into the question box um, that you should be able to see on your screen now, and we'll ensure that you get added to the Princess Weekly. And the Princess Weekly has a wealth of information on it. So we include all of our latest campaign, pricing information, um, product update, and news with Princess. So it's uh, your first and only port of call for um, all things Princess. So moving on and in summary. As I said earlier on today, we have had an absolutely spectacular year with Princess. We've made an absolutely brilliant start to next year for 2014 over the last couple of months with our Cruise Extra campaign. And we hope today's briefing has helped you to speak confidently and passionately about the new exciting memories that your customers can make on board a Princess Cruise. And some of the little things that we do on board that means your customers will want to come back time and time again. In addition, our three for free offer with a low deposit and third and fourth places, as I said, for £99 means it is really the perfect time to book with Princess. I'd like to thank each of you for taking the time to join us today. I appreciate that everyone is very busy in the run up to Christmas and we greatly value the partnership that we have with each of you and we're really looking forward to working together for an even more successful year in 2014. We'd now like to invite you to ask any questions that you may have um, so please do um, post these on the question function on your screen now. As I said, myself and Shane will be staying on the webinar um, and we will be able to answer any questions that you might have. Um, you can follow us on Twitter at Princess UK Sales. Please feel free to post any questions that you may have on there and be sure to follow us through Wave as we'll be keeping you up to speed with everything that we're working on. So to finish, on behalf of myself, Shane and the whole Princess Cruises team here in the UK, I'd like to, like to wish you a very Merry Christmas and we hope you will have a wonderful um, and happy new year. And we look forward to um, welcoming you back in January as we kick off um, our WAVE campaign to make it one of the most successful ones we've ever had. So thank you very much for your attention. Have a great day. Thanks very much.